Chinaman here, and today the video is going to be um, about two things. One is, you've heard of how-to videos. This is a how-not-to video, specifically how not to pack and ship China. The other part of the video is going to be showing you a um, somewhat unique piece that you may or may not have heard of before and what it's actually used for. They kind of go together, though, because when I got home today, I had a package in the mail. This is fine china. Fine china should not be shipped in a bag. Um, I have no idea if this china is okay. Um, I'm waiting to open it until right now, so we're going to go ahead and open it together. Um, it may be okay because I don't really hear anything jiggling around, um, but this is not the way to send fine china. This is from eBay. Um, the item is a somewhat rare piece. So let's open it up and see if it's okay. Okay, envelope inside of another envelope. Okay. I think there's another envelope inside of this one. Let's find out. I was hoping it'd be a box, a small box inside of here, but so far no box. This is great. Look at that. Have you ever seen a piece of china wrapped like this? Well, maybe it made it. Let's see. It feels like it's in one piece. Let's see. It is in one piece. Okay, this is great. Let's check it out. Whenever I first get a piece of china, I always check the edges to make sure there's no chips, and I also look for cracks or crazing. Um, specifically, I uh, buy pieces that are considered excellent condition. I don't buy a piece that's crazed intentionally ever. Um, there are no marks around the edge. I'm feeling it's good. Um, let's look at the back here. Uh, there's some dirt along the bottom, which I saw in the description. That's fine. That's not a problem. Backstamp, England. Very important. Um, looks really good. Looks very good. Excellent condition. Now, what do you think this piece is? Let me tell you what it was advertised as. A soap dish or trinket dish. It's not a soap dish or a trinket dish. This is called a sweet meat dish. A somewhat rare piece, a piece that we don't often hear about anymore. Now, some of you, when you hear sweet meat, are probably thinking, oh, this may be some type of a candied uh, lump of beef or something. I don't know. That's not what sweet meat is. Sweet meat is actually candies, um, maybe bonbons, etc. But um, quite often it is candied or sugar coated fruit. So, fruit candies. That's what these dishes were used for. They're very small, but again, you would have several of them on here, and uh, people could take a sweet off of the sweet meat tray. So that is what this piece is. I'm going to bring it up close to you so you can see it. Um, but one more thing I will mention about this. Uh, this was pretty good as far as what was inside here. I mean, this, this is pretty, pretty strong. But you know what? I still can push just about through it. It made it okay, but still, I would never send a piece of fine china in a bag. Not what you want to do. Um, I've ordered a lot from eBay, and I'll tell you, I have had many items come broken or shattered from eBay. I would say my success rate on eBay isn't much more than 50% if you combine breakage along with items not as described. So be aware of that. Just because you find something more wonderful on eBay, don't assume you have it until it's actually in hand and unpacked. 
Well, let me show you this up close. Okay, here it is up close. And just so you know, this is Lady Carlisle by Royal Albert. And this piece um, is made in England, which is an important uh, thing to always check. It says Royal Albert Bone China, England. Lady Carlisle, night, copyright 1944, Royal Albert LDD, LTD. This uh, set is my wife and um, my wedding set. And uh, as you probably noticed behind me in the hutch that I sit in front of, uh, this pattern is um, in there. So uh, this is a, a neat pattern because not only was it um, made in England for many years, it also um, has a lot of interesting pieces, such as this uh, sweet meat dish. If you like this video, please click the like button below, and make sure you subscribe as we're going to be putting out many more videos. Have a great day.